Alright guys, it's Wheeling the Tomboy Gamer here and you've been wondering uh, what is this uh, logo? So apparently if you guys don't know uh, which company is this, I'm going to tell you. This company was actually from Video Burden Co. Before the Hell in the Magic Book and other non-English movies came out, eventually what I was going to say is that there was actually a terrible company from Brazil which is actually called Video Burden Co. So as you may know about really Video Burden Co, it's actually a Toyland video which is translated for it's translated as toy video. It was formerly known as VVS for this and sport spot films. So eventually these guys seriously did a lot of bad, bad movies ever since 1986. So eventually, what I was gonna say is these movies definitely do look terrible. Look what I even mean, guys. Look what I even mean. You know what, guys? I just do believe that Video Boiling Co. was definitely like the worst. You see what they apparently do with all these Brazilian videos? What I was gonna say is that, yeah, they just did like horrible horrible videos but let me just tell you something this straight okay so eventually it was uh producing white films such as walt disney pictures pixar uh dreamworks 20th century fox and blue sky studios so what i'm gonna say is that these ripoffs actually copied from the original movies such as the little cars in the great race which is a ripoff of cars Rat Toying, which is a ripoff of Ratatouille. Gladiformers, which is a ripoff of Transformers. The Little Cars 2, Robopolis Adventure, which is a ripoff of Cars. The Little Panda Fighter, which is a ripoff of Kung Fu Panda. Tiny Robots, which is a ripoff of Wally and Robots. Little Princess School, it's a ripoff of the various Disney princesses. But I'm just gonna still explain. Exclude Elsa and Anna because I do believe that uh, they weren't in this lineup. So eventually, let me just read some more of this, okay? So, The Little Cars 3, The Fast and the Curious. Now, what I was gonna say is definitely a ripoff of Cars again. Gladiformers 2, it's a ripoff of Transformers 2, Little and Big Monsters, which is a ripoff of Monsters vs. Aliens and The Incredibles. And What's up? Balloons the Rescue, which is a ripoff of Up, and The Frog Prince is the ripoff of prin The Princess and the Frog. But overall, these films are, like, um, just go for 40 minutes of length. They had to like have the minimum as the feature quality film of uh, distribution. So what I was going to say is that um, there's actually the Disney's legal department, which was actually confronted by this um, hoarder, which is actually a potential lawsuit. You know what? I was actually very, very happy because the studio actually did went bankrupt after winding down the operations further. It was actually like the duplication and the fall of this duplication of Video Burling Co. So what I was going to say is I really hate it. I really hate that company. Do you know why I really hate that company? Well, I'm going to tell you three reasons why I really hate it. Now, eventually, it ruined some of the movies from Disney, Pixar, DreamWorks, and Blue Sky. It was including 20th Century Fox, which I actually forgot to put it. So I'm just gonna put it. All right. So actually, yeah, they just ripped off like 20th Century Fox for uh, some of the movies, like Monsters vs. Aliens. Actually, a twin. It's actually a DreamWorks movie, if I'm not mistaken. I'll just say it's um. What's, what is it? Maybe it's um, Hasbro. I guess maybe it's Hasbro. So eventually it has distributed like foreign cartoons such as the Japanese cartoon Sonic X, The Adventures of Super Mario, We Little Lulu, and every kind of fairy tale film. I mean Video Bulunko seriously had plagiarized like some movies. You know what? It also just have Rapunzel, you know, like Rapunzel, which is also a ripoff of Tangled. You know what I almost forgot to mention about Video Berlinko? You see Video Berlinko actually um, uh, made the movie Kiara the Brave. But that one was actually a ripoff to Disney Pixar's Brave. Like I mean, when will they ever like stop plagiarizing movies? You know plagiarizing movies is illegal. You could get 
sent to jail, you could get yourself bankrupt, you know, like that. It was like totally unacceptable. You know what? So they put Tiny Robots, which is a ripoff of robots, which is actually a blue sky movie, if I'm not mistaken. I forgot to really add this one in Twitter. It was Blue Sky Studios, which was actually by 20th Century Fox. So eventually, guys, uh, what I was going to say is that I forgot to really add this one in my Twitter tweet, you know. Anyways, guys, I just wanted to like really, really say something about it, okay? Now, what I was going to say is that Video Brilliant Co. does copy a lot of films. You know what? The characters are definitely awful. And you know why Video Berlinko shouldn't do all these kinds of plagiarizing movies? Such as Lights of Jungle, Africa's Most Wanted, which is a ripoff of Madagascar 3, Europe's Most Wanted. You know what they also have? They also have Little B, which is a ripoff of B movie. <sighs> what I was gonna say is that Video Berlinko is definitely Worse, and these are like the knockoffs, you know? You know what? What I really do think of Rat Toying? Rat Toying is definitely like the worst, um, the worst movie that have ever existed, you know? You know what? What I'm really gonna say? What's wrong with the video really co films? They copy each other, they mainstream other films, and it's poor. The, the animation is definitely poor. But I'm really happy that it really um went bankrupt, you know. So eventually, it just uh, been accused for creating um many films. They just plagiarized it, and I mean, why won't they actually stop plagiarizing films, you know? And apparently, plagiarizing films is not okay. It is considered illegal. It can get you arrested, like. For example, pirated VHS. Pirated VHS is illegal and it could get you arrested. If you watch a movie, please read the FBI warning in the US or you could read the warning screen which is uh, in Malaysia or even somewhere around here. Like I give you an example, but I'm still going to read it, not going to show you the picture, okay? So I'm really going to say this warning. If you ever see these knockoff films, please do not watch them. They are high-rated movies. So eventually what I was going to say is that the authorization uh, reproduction, broadcasting, uh, screening, public performance of, of or renting this disc is prohibited by law. And I mean, every time Video Berlinko F produces like a disc or a CD, it's, it's like, oh, you want to watch it, you want to buy it. But no, it's illegal. It's still illegal in uh, some countries like uh, the Philippines or even Malaysia. So eventually what I was going to say is that uh, this has actually been protected by uh, Video Berlinko. And an authorized duplication could lead into like uh, law. So it's not okay actually. It's really like not okay to copy like any other movies. I mean it's plagiarism. It's plagiarism. You could get yourself sent to jail. Video piracy is definitely crime. So what I was gonna say is that Video Berlinko did a lot of these knockoffs and I'll just consider them as uh, pirated videos, you know, it's like pirated. What I was gonna say is this, whenever you see like a Brazilian morning screen, you probably just read and say this. It will probably appear in Video Berlinko if I'm not mistaken. So eventually, Video Berlinko is one of the worst companies in Brazil. You know what I even mean? like that. Now eventually, what I was gonna say is, is that um, they actually did copy the 2003 Pixar film Finding Nemo, Kingdom Under the Sea, and Finding Nemo has similar similarities. 2D was actually based on fairy tales such as Pinocchio and the Three Little Pigs. So what I was gonna say is that they definitely did rip off a lot of these kind of movies, you know, it's like terrible. Video Berlinko was definitely one of the worst um, things that can ever happen to uh, other people, especially when you're just trying to uh, watch it, you know. So what I'm gonna say is that this. I'm gonna say this. <clears throat> Well, I'm gonna read the warning screen to you because you know how much you want to watch this movie. Definitely, guys.
I don't want to be mean to you, okay? So let me just find another one. All right. And I don't really kind of understand like, what it's saying, but I'm just gonna read it in like uh, Bahasa Indonesia, cause you know, like that. Dia bilang, melakan, melakan ulang, berbayang, ubla, berbayang, berbayang, isi, makan program, program, visi ini. Dengan cegan apon tanpa ini to the story. I'll just say the long mention means warning. So actually, I just, I don't know what to do already now. So I'm just gonna like read the English one. I don't kind of know, but just kind of understand what I'm gonna like really um, say, you know? So I'm so sorry, guys. I'm so sorry if I have to bring this one up to you, but definitely the reason why I'm gonna read to you these warning screens is because I don't know if it's like really, really that related or really necessary to uh, read this one in order to avoid watching this film because it is plagiarized, but I'm very happy it is bankrupt. All rights reserved. This video program is for private use only and prohibits any other you copying, reproduction, or performance in public, in whole or part. Well, just prohibits like copying, you know, like it's similar to when um, Pixar did get copy like a lot of these kinds of knockoffs, you know? You know what I even mean? Video Berlin Co. definitely is the worst company that can really happen. Now, eventually, guys, there's one more thing I want to say about Video Berlin Co. You know what? What I even found from this video? This video doesn't for the frog prince definitely does not look like Tiana. Alright. And the little prince's school? Well, I'm just gonna say something about this. The little prince's school is definitely a knockoff. You know? It's definitely a knockoff. So what I was gonna say is that uh, there were actually other princesses. Cindy is a ripoff of Cinderella. Bianca is a ripoff of Snow White. Haim is a ripoff of Mulan. Zayd is a ripoff of Jasmine. So eventually what I was gonna say is that the little princess school is awful and the queen, you know what guys? The queen definitely uh is definitely a ripoff of the queen. Like Like the queen, you know, the evil queen from Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. I mean, when will this, when will this thing like ever, ever stop, you know? Now eventually what I was going to say is that it is not okay to plagiarize and copy other films, you know? Like, for example, Mega Powers. It's a close resemblance, but it's also a ripoff of the Power Rangers. And it's Adventures of Raudo, which is actually a ripoff of Flushed Away. So eventually, what I was gonna say is, it's definitely like horrible, you know. You see, like all these like ripoff companies. This doesn't even look like Rodi. The other one doesn't look like Rita, you know. This one looks like Remy. These ones I don't know. This one I don't know. So eventually, guys, I suggest you guys don't watch Video Berlinko because of this. It's very poor, and the English Rita has been has been reproduced poorly you know like poorly so eventually guys i think that could be all for now just a reminder for you guys if you ever see these kinds of knockoff films i suggest you guys do not watch video berlinko video berlinko is one of the worst movies that people ever watched especially for people like me you know like southeast asians now what i'm gonna say is i suggest you guys don't watch it because they have poor qualities and the video apparently gets plagiarized every time they want to copy it. You could get sent to jail if you do that. Plagiarism is not okay for any movie, you know that? Now what I was going to say is that I was right and the Hell Fanboy 2004 actually did create a post on why he really hated this show. I mean, his prediction was actually correct to say that he hated it, you know? he hated. Video Berlinko because it copied every every type of movie, you know? You know what I mean? So in the Hell Fanboy 2004's 
prediction was actually correct on his Instagram post. So I even had to agree with him to say that, oh, the prediction was definitely um right due to that. Video Berlinko was definitely the one just trying to uh, copy movies from different from different American companies. You you know what I even mean like that? It's like terrible. It's terrible. So I recommend everyone not to watch this. Okay. But anyways, I think that's enough talking for now. And this is me, Wheeling the Tomboy Gamer, signing off.